Hey guys, it's Joelle. And Amanda. How's your guys' week going? Ours has been pretty good. Um, I get a little bit of a break because I get to go to work. So the quarantine isn't as bad for me, but for them. I don't get to leave the house. <laughs> we do go on walks. We we go on mile walks and just explore our neighborhood. And the other day we found tadpoles. So that was super fun. Have you guys been doing anything um, outside or any crafts? Um, let us know. Did you guys know it's Good Friday? This is a great time for everybody to just reflect and remember and think about the sacrifices Jesus Christ has done for us. You know, the, the, the amount of sacrifice he gave for us gave us the grace to be able to be saved and be in his grace. So take some time, whether it's today or sometime before Sunday, and just really stop and show Jesus your gratitude for his sacrifices. Let's get into our devotional. Astronomical grace. Those who are in Christ Jesus are not judged guilty. Romans 8, 1. When I look up at the stars and think about how huge space is, so astronomically huge that scientists have never even glimpsed the edges of it, I feel a bit, well, tiny. But then I think about how amazing it all is and how amazing that means God is. He made all of it. And even more amazing is the fact that the one who made everything also loves you and me. Proof of God's love and grace is all around us. It's as if all of creation is God's way of saying, I love you. Don't believe it? Just look at what's inside of the heart of the Whirlpool Galaxy. The Whirlpool Galaxy lies some 30 million light years away. And tucked inside it is something called the X structure. Scientists tell us the dark X marks the exact spot of a big of a black hole so big that it is equal to one million of our suns. It's so astronomically big that it's 1,100 light years across. That's amazing. But I believe X marks the spot of something more than just a black hole. Because if you tilt your head just a little bit, that X looks just like a cross. And it marks the spot of yet another reminder of God's astronomical love and grace. You see, God sent Jesus to earth to live and die on a cross. Why? So your sins could be forgiven and you could be with God. That's called grace. And no matter what you've done, no matter what mistake, what sin, what mess you've made, God is ready to forgive you. You just have to ask because God's grace isn't just big. It isn't just huge. It's astronomical. Lord, Sometimes I feel as if I've messed everything up. Thank you, Lord, for your astronomical grace that forgives and covers even my biggest sins. Isn't that amazing, guys? A black hole that big? That is amazing. And then to know that there is a center, right? Because our center, the center of our living and the way that we are is God. And God is so astronomical, right? He is so big and so huge that he is he has eyes on everything. He has control of everything. It is amazing, just so amazing how big God is and how he loves us so much when we are so much smaller. So whatever you're going through today, just remember that. Let's pray. Lord God, we thank you for this time to remember and reflect on your son's sacrifice for us for the love that you show us and the guidance that you give us throughout our lives. We ask you this night, Lord God, to protect us and watch over us and continue to help us and guide us through this, uh, these times, that we would get through these and realize that your grace still abounds beyond all others. We ask for your blessing in Jesus' name. Amen.